Today, we're gonna to calibrate an inline sensor head using the calibration blocks at the MCU cabinet. First, you're gonna go ahead and hit mode until we get to the distance calibration screen. There, we're gonna go ahead and hit select to begin the process. And you're basically just gonna follow the onboard instructions. We're gonna go ahead and place the 1.87 piece on the bottom of the plate, which will look like this. If you can read the numbers, then you have the correct side. When calibrating the inline sensor head, it's important to note that there is two flat painted sides for your 2.625 and your 1.875. If you can read those, then you are on the correct side. So you're just gonna go ahead and place that squared in there like that, and you're gonna go ahead and remove all of your lens, tools, and anything from the capacitance area inside here. And we're going to go ahead and hit select once that's placed down there. Once it's taken the reading, we're going to go ahead and flip that block to read the 2.625. You're going to flip it to the other side to read that longer measurement. And same thing, clearing hands away. Once that's placed under there, we're going to hit select. It's gonna save your new factor and new offset by hitting select. Once those values are written and saved, you're gonna go ahead and hit mode to get back to the main static screen. And that's how you calibrate an inline sensor head. For more information, visit finagroup.com slash SCSFP.